But my experience is that people who have been through painful, difficult times are filled with compassion. More important than talent, strength, or knowledge is the ability to laugh at yourself and enjoy the pursuit of your dreams. I can look at the future with anticipation. And it's comforting to know that someday, as Christians, we'll be able to look back and have a little more clarity on why certain things in life happened. Life is a process, and you just take it a day at a time, and you can't live in tomorrow, and you can't reach back and be in yesterday. No matter how much you want to, you just have what's right there in front of you. I count myself really fortunate that I have some lifelong friends. The best thing about a friend is when you are being your own worst enemy a friend can help snap you out of it. Get outside. Watch the sunrise. Watch the sunset. How does that make you feel? Does it make you feel big or tiny? Because there's something good about feeling both. Anybody who's ever gone through a hard time any outsider's perception, no matter how much information they're given, they have no idea what the person's life is like. Without black, no color has any depth. But if you mix black with everything, suddenly there's shadow, no, not just shadow, but fullness. You've got to be willing to mix black into your palette if you want to create something that's real. I think what I mostly realize is just that life is unpredictable. So don't be afraid, but just enjoy the day you're in. Really make the most of it. All I ever have to be is what you made me. I refuse to believe that we're only here to live and die. You do your best, you do all this stuff, but the only thing that counts is faith expressing itself through love. If it all just happened overnight, you would never learn to believe in what you cannot see. If you went to your closet today, would you pull out the same outfit you wore 10 or 15 years ago? You wear feelings and faith differently as well. You have to treat people gently because we're all in a process. What might seem like a good idea to somebody at 21 is probably not going to seem like a good idea at 50, but you don't know that until you get there. There's a beauty to wisdom and experience that cannot be faked. It's impossible to be mature without having lived. The secret to overcoming a feeling of loneliness is not going outside to meet people. That will only keep you from being alone. The secret is going inside yourself, to realize your true kinship with God and with all the human beings that he created. I think our culture encourages all of us to always put our best foot forward. I think it's a good thing. I think it's nice to rise to the occasion, to be kind and considerate, and have self-control. How we absorb music is unique. I know what I do. When I'm listening to music, I tend to find myself in a song. That's what really makes you connect is if you feel what that song is saying. I've found that music allows years to fold like an accordion over each other, so I guess you don't feel the passage of time as much. I need music like I need water. It's true. I'm a simple person. Some people tend to live from trauma to trauma, and that energizes them. I have a hectic schedule, but my mind seeks simplicity, like being in nature, a long bike ride, or sitting on the back porch. People are going to come into your life that need you, and being there for them makes the day worth living. People are going to come into your life that you need, and that's the really crazy thing. There is not a formula for the way that God heals there's not a timetable. The more time you invest in a marriage, the more valuable it becomes. I think a woman can have all of the ideas and mental pictures. She can be a real planner and a motivator. But in the end, I think a woman does best when she responds to a man. 
Life goes by really fast, and it seems that there are times when you're burying a lot of friends and family. And then there are times that feel really precious and everybody is doing okay. This is one of those times. I'm going to live what I believe. Every good relationship, especially marriage, is based on respect. If it's not based on respect, nothing that appears to be good will last very long. Depending on what day of the week it is and what time of the month it is, I'm a good friend or not a good friend. I'm more or less a good mom or not a good mom, more or less a good mate or not a good mate. That's just life, whether or not you're public. The great thing about a song is that no one has to know your story. But if you tell it in a way that has clarity and means something to somebody else, then it can apply to their story. Man hurts man, time and time again. As we drown in the wake of our power, somebody tell me why. It takes a little time sometimes to get your feet back on the ground. Since I travel so much, it's always great to be home. There's nothing like getting to raid my own refrigerator at 2 in the morning. I know my own weaknesses as a human being, and as a musician, as a singer and as a woman. In the past, when I'd recorded during a break in a tour, it was so easy to sing, because I felt strong. Also, like so many new mothers, I wasn't getting a lot of sleep, and sleeping is such a huge part of being able to sing. You live in a dangerous place when you sacrifice integrity for security. I don't write songs that don't affect me on some level, because I figure if I am not moved by it, if it's not something that I have a longing to celebrate or to be reminded of, if it doesn't affect me, then how can I possibly think it is going to affect somebody else? My touchstone is writing something that matters. Real relationship is gritty and earthy, the stuff that life is made of. I write about everything, but I just, how faith filters through all that and colors your opinion of other people and life and all that. I love being with my children. They're fascinating people. To me, the human experience does involve a great deal of anguish. It's joyful, but it's bittersweet. I just think that's life. I think that if my kids are completely convinced of God's unfailing love for them, whether they fail or not, they will have confidence to persevere in life. The most consistent musical experience I had growing up was church music. Love's for fools wise enough to take a chance. I did the best I could, and in some arenas, my best was not good enough. I've made some bad choices. I'm not anxious to be anywhere other than where I am right now. The same rain that drowns the rat will grow the hay. Everybody needs a helping hand, take a look at your fellow man. It's human nature to be curious about people, and to be more curious about young people than old people. We want to cheer something on at the same time we want to tear it down. That's just so normal. I never thought getting older would be so great. But when it comes to depression, I have experienced less the older I've gotten. Which quote did you like the most? Share your opinion in the comments below. Subscribe and don't miss out the chance to see the next video.